What up, what up, what up? It's your boy P.E. to the P.E. Positive Energy. A.K.A. Bug Buck. A.K.A. H.I. A.K.A. Regan the Vegan. First and foremost, September 21st in Philly is going down. The gold is back. Cassidy, the problem. First Arsenal, the rapper. <laughs> Go check www. TheRealBRC.com. I'm about to start this off with like, I know y'all hear the music in the background. This is the reason why I don't like the radio. Because they don't play shit like this. Like, to me, this is got everything you need for a radio single. I heard this track, man. I was hot when I was younger. When I was younger, when I was younger, I was dumb. I'm about to be dumb again. I'm trying to get my chicken up. Listen, get my chicken up. I don't understand how that that is not like the shit that y'all want to play on the radio. Y'all want to play that other bullshit. That's <coughs> why. Y'all get a lot of love from, <coughs> from me on the radio. <coughs> I just don't be interested. Y'all don't play this shit I like. So, that's that and that's there. Yeah, I'm just here really talking some shit. A little bit of shit. What I want to talk about is... I don't know, I'm freestyling right now, but y'all feel, do y'all feel, do y'all feel the energy and the vibe that's surrounding the TRBRC right now, how these motherfuckers is real, real mad, bro, these niggas is really, really mad, like, it, they, they really mad, bro. And again, I'm 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 gonna start this. Why I fucks with cats heavy on my channel, especially when I'm talking about battle rap, because he did go to battle rap. And y'all, you are hell, all you other bloggers and all that shit. It's being extra disrespectful to the man who started this shit. Y'all don't want to see the shit that was real, like. It's like, again, let me explain this to y'all. Do I think it's possible for Cassie to be, be beat? Yeah. He can get beat. He just ain't been beat yet. Y'all ain't seen a nigga, so it make it seem like he can't be beat, and the motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? I don't, he's never going to be the underdog to me in a, in a battle. I don't, like, even if with Jada, like, one of my favorite artists, that's why I asked him about this shit, like, even with Jada, I still would put, in a battle, I'm going to take Cass, bro, like, and Jada is my nigga, bro, like, like, y'all act like just because we rock with Cass and we the TRBRC, that we can't be objective. Let me tell you about me, bro. Take cast out of the equation. Alright. Now, if you have cast battling, ain't no question I'm watching it. Checking it out, trying to see what's going down, period. So, we, so, if he got a battle, my interest level is already going up there anyway. Two reasons. One, I like battle rap. Certain aspects of battle rap, I like. I like when I can get the bars, the real bars, because you don't get them type of bars in industry. I like that. And I like the fact that when Cass comes, the 
the battle is already going to be at an extra high level of it. Because of they per, they perception of him being an industry rapper. Which is kind of like a double-edged sword. Yeah, he going to bring us there. But to me, I never, ever, ever thought Cass was no industry rapper. See, the industry rapper to me, in my term for industry rappers, is guys whose main focus is on making radio singles. And that's what they're trying to do. Make a hit record so they can... And not making good music and dropping bars. So, I don't really get into the them type of rappers. I like the bars. Just like Jada. Like, you know what I'm saying? He got bars with his shit. <clears throat> so, uh, I don't write to none of that music. That's cast as shit. I ain't mean to let it play that long. Um, you know, the type of guys I like to listen to <clears throat> is lyrical to me, in my eyes. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I fuck with Jada. Fuck with Cass. This is before any of this battle rap goods type shit. I fuck with with Cass. Sorry. Um, Woo. Fuck with a little Nas. A little, uh, and I. This the thing. I ain't been up on. I don't listen to a lot of new shit because it don't hold me, and it just be this. Same old shit. I don't really get into Drake and all that. I fuck with the clips, Pusha T and clips. I fuck with them, roll with them. <clears throat> um, um, so it's not like I'm, I, I never liked club music type shit. I ain't like. Like, I ain't never liked the no Nelly. I ain't never, like, no no disrespect to anybody, I'm saying. Because, like I said before, to make music and, and all this, either whether it's battle rap or red rap, it's still somebody's art. Whether I choose to like that art or not, somebody sees a talent in that person. It's just that maybe I don't see it or I, maybe I don't agree with it or it's not my taste in talent that I like. like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that club music, trap music can be dope for people who make it, but that's not what, that's not what I want to listen to and what I'm into, that's not going to move me to be like, you know what I'm saying, so, <clears throat> when they say Migos is the coldest group ever, y'all can judge that how y'all want to, y'all can say he cool, and I'm not taking nothing away from Migos, they cool, they all that, <clears throat> they make hot trap music, I'm just not a trap music fan. I mean, you, you get some beats and Bob, but I want to understand you when you rap. And that's why I never got into, like, Twister when he came out with his fast rapping style because <clears throat> I need to understand you. And this, when you talk, when you rap it, part of the reason why they don't like Cass is because he lets you hear and he pronunciates syllables so you can catch those syllables when he's rhyming them. So he has to slow it down for y'all so y'all understand the fucking rhyme so that y'all can catch it and y'all to each his own. You don't have to like that. You don't have to like that. You can be like, that's cool. No problem here that you don't like what I like. I don't give a fuck. I don't I don't feel I have to have a need to be justified by everybody else liking what I like to feel that okay, it's cool to like this. See that's what people do. They need justification from other people to justify what they like instead of just liking what they like, whether somebody would agree with it or whatever. So <clears throat> me <clears throat> it's like I don't know, man. It's some of these dudes who just, like, they, they just like the troll. Like, they, they, like, it's like, it'd be frustrating. Like, why in the world do you, if you don't like something, you got to express some type of, like, if I don't like something, I just basically don't talk about it or fuck with it too much um, 
maybe on a passing example type level, like, of, yeah, of, okay, I will say something I don't like in, in a situation like this one I'm trying to explain you, but on the, on the regular, I'm not just going to be <clears throat> doing a video about some, man, I can't stand this dude, I don't know why he do this, I don't know why he do that, I don't know why he make this type of music, I don't like, you know what I'm saying, people might make music that I don't like. I don't, I don't, I don't think I'm the fucking judge all of everything. Like, oh, you must listen to positive energy because his way is the way, and you should. He he got it figured out. So if he say it's dope, you should just listen to him. Nigga, I don't give a fuck if you like what I like, nigga. So nigga, do you know how many times people told me I was corny for liking the woo? Like, you know what I'm saying? And I take that as a badge of honor. Good, I got something that y'all don't got. I, I know these motherfucking bars. I can spit some niggas, some fusion of the five elements to search for a higher intelligence. Women walk around celibate, living irrelevant. The most benevolent king communicating through your dreams, mental pages being painted. Our laws hurting, seen everywhere throughout your surrounding atmosphere, troposphere, thermosphere, stratosphere. Can you imagine from one single idea, everything a point here? Understanding makes my truth crystal clear. Innocent black immigrants locked in housing tenements, 85% tend to depend on welfare recipients. See, y'all don't know nothing about them type of bars, that's the shit I'm talking about, shout out to Bob Digital, them was his bars, not mine, RZA, on motherfucking impossible, y'all niggas don't know about real bars, like, so y'all can't tell me about bars, nigga, y'all motherfuckers, URL, app gang niggas, act like y'all motherfuckers, the only, like, if you don't know URL battle rappers, and you don't know nothing about rapping, nigga, get the fuck out of here. Y'all motherfuckers is ooing and awing over goods, taking this jacket off. How the fuck y'all gonna really tell me about some bars? Y'all you know what I'm saying? Y'all y'all motherfuckers is still trying to get this motherfucker credit for hopping in the box like Double Dutch. Y'all motherfuckers know he biting the motherfucker. This is why, and still giving him in the past. This is why Nas, Ether J, how many... Biggie Rhymes gonna come out your fat lips when he called him on you always biting Biggie shit. Nigga, game over. I don't give a fuck about no super ugly. Nothing you bring up after that, Jay-Z. It's over with. Nigga, he came, y'all talking about personals and all this other shit. He came with personals that was effective and real. In 88, you was getting chased in my building, calling my crib, and I ain't even give you my numbers. All I did was give you a style for you to run with. When he, this the story, like, like I, you know, saying this is just the story. I don't know Jay Z. I don't know Nas. I ain't grow up in QB. I ain't grow up in in Brooklyn in, in Marcy. I don't got no connects with none of these. But story has it. Nas told Jay, "Hey, bro, same shit. I'm trying to tell y'all about the fast rapping because Jay Z used to rap off ass. You be spitting dope shit." But nobody can understand what you're saying. They can't catch your bar. Slow that shit down so motherfuckers can hear you and hear what you're saying. Slow this shit down. He don't spit that. He uh, next thing you know, it's the hard from standing on the corners bopping. Stopping some of the hottest verses rap has ever heard. You feel that? You feel that now? You, he slowed that shit down when he could have been in. But he slowed this shit down and let you hear it. And, and, and the shit came out. It's the hard nut. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And motherfuckers be talking about. <clears throat> only thing I didn't agree with Nas on that. Is when he said Eminem killed him on his own shit. Disagree on that. Like Jay, That was to me. Was one of Jay's hardest verses. That second verse on Renegade was crazy. I had to hustle. Back to the wall, ashy knuckles, pockets filled with a lot of lint. Not a cent, got a vent. A lot of innocent lies left on the project bench. What you hollering? Gotta pay rent, bring dollars in. By the bodega, iron under my coat. Feeling braver, do rag, wrapping my ways in pockets filled with hope. Do not step, be I'm awkward. I box left, the off of my pops left me. And off of my mama wasn't alone. 
could not stress to me I wasn't grown. Especially on nights I brought something home to quiet the stomach rumblings. My demeanor, 30 years my senior, my crowdhood didn't mean much. Only raising green up. Raising my fingers to the critics, raising my head to the sky. Big, I did it. More time before I die. No lot, man. Whoo! And then, see, every everything has a little off point. Even some of the greatest shit. At the end, he went back to his biting rhyme style because he took from the fucking woo when he said he rolled by the rope, fork in the road and went straight. Woo had already spit that shit. Dude, so, so, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, the nigga was on fire with that. Now, as far as that was, <clears throat> Jay got some craziest verses ever, bro. Like, y'all can't, the what man, um, the Watcher, bet between that and the Watcher verse, like, okay, y'all motherfuckers, do, like, uh, this, this is what I'm talking about, bar. If y'all can't talk of, know what bars is after this, nigga, and painting pictures and letting the niggas see what things, this ain't the same for gangsters, but I'm a little too famous to shoot these pranksters. All of these games, what do he say? Uh, all these rap singers claiming these bangers, doing all sorts of twisted shit with their fingers, disrespecting the game, the home training, the manners. I was doing this shit when you were shitting in Pampers. I was moving them grams for you. Knew what a hand to hand was, ducking the vans, radars, and scanners. Before you knew what hard white and tan was. I was hitting turnpike hype with them bammers. I was hype with my hands because I'm hype with them hams. I messed it up a little bit. I was pricking my finger before you knew what a fam was. 300 mil later, now you understand us. You ever see us coming through Vegas? You ever see so much sham busting one night? Grand fucked in one fight? I was on the Peter Pan bus. You was putting Peter Pan up in your room. Y'all fucking with whom? Allow me to retort. You cowards are just now learning the shit that we talk. You ain't know shit about a rob report. About a high speed post. I.E. You niggas ain't know how to floss till I came in the door like Eric B. For prayers respect me in this bitch. You can't disrespect us because you got a little check cut. You was sucking up so long fucking your little neck up. Now you're too big for your bitches. You got a few little bitches you thinking you have but you're just ridiculous. I blew breath in you niggas. I gave life to the game. It's only right I got the right to be king. Niggas that got life really like what I'm saying. K, they know it's real life. Niggas feel my pain. Bitch. No, the shit I don't write be the illest shit that's ever been recited in the game. Words the hyphen in my name. J A Y dash. Bitch. Bars, nigga. Y'all talk about bars. Dope shit, man. Man, for real. Like, you know what I'm saying? This is real shit. This is, this, this, the T-R-B-R-C. It's real. It's real. It's battling. And it's rap, man. You know what I'm saying? We gonna be real first. Then we gonna fuck with the battles. But it's all about the rapping. So go check out the real. BRC.com. September 21st. In Philly, it goes down. Cast the goat. First R's the revenue. Y'all know what it is.